is a quick tutorial on how to free draw or add text comments onto a PDF document. So I started by opening a PDF document. And what we can do is add some buttons to our tool set that will allow us to draw freely, to erase, or to add text comments directly onto our document. So if we click on the settings button, and then we can look at under annotations, there's all of these kind of tools that are available. So I selected add text comment and then selected for it to be added to my top toolbar here. I also went to the drawing markups and selected draw freeform and erase freeform and I also added those to my top toolbar so that I could use them with just one click. Once those are added and you click save, they will show up on your top bar. So if I wanted to free draw on this document, I can click on the pencil and then it will give me this little star which will then follow my mouse and I can draw directly on the document. If I wanted to erase it, I can just hit Control Z which will undo. If you want to select different colors or weights for the free drawing, you can have the pencil selected and hit Control E which will bring up the properties for the pencil tool and you can select from a variety of colors, select from a variety of weights um, for that. And then, so for now we wanted to use something in green. We can change it to more of a green color. And then again, Control Z. I can undo what I had just put in there. If I wanted to use more of a text, I can click on the text and create a little text box area. You can change the color of the text. You can also change the size of the text once you have it in there. Again, you want to undo it, Control Z takes it off of there. So this is a great option if you are screencasting and you want to be able to write along with your information or type along with your information so it's easier for the students to read. Um, once you're finished and you close the document, you can save it. You can save as something new with all of your notes and then post it to Schoology or you can save it right over, or if you don't need it, you can just close it out and you don't have to save it. Hope this was helpful. Let me know if you have any questions. Thanks.